little fermentation update. We had a great superfoods class this weekend where we all learned how to make bone stock. We did a bone stock demo. We did a kombucha demo. Everyone walked away with their own kombucha starter kit. We did a cultured vegetable demo and everyone made their own kimchi and sauerkraut. And we did it the real way with some whey and some active cultures. And then when everyone bottled it, they were supposed to leave a couple of inches of space at the top of the jar so it could expand and, and ferment a little bit. And some people didn't, so that stuff started to, to seep out. And, um, and so I had to go in and make some adjustments to everybody's stuff. This one's doing beautiful, a little too full. You can notice there's a lot of pressure on the top here. I'm gonna crack this open. And then look what's happening inside there. Look at all those bubbles and stuff. That's good stuff. I can't believe how active this stuff is. So all I'm gonna do is just pull a little bit off the top. Bring it down to just, above, just uh, below the line of the jar there. I'm going to try to submerge the plant matter down below it. Look at all this care and TLC taken with these babies. I'm going to recap it. And now I'm going to take this. I got my own scrap little jar with extra stuff in it. And I'll probably eat that. That is it. That's what this is all about. We got our little kombucha starter cultures here. We got several jars of kimchi that have been slightly readjusted. We got my scrap kimchi here. I got kimchi going on up here. I got uh, fermenting garlic cloves going on here. I got the master tonic going on here. Like we're just full of fermentation.